What is going on? Reefing fam, March here. This is Fragbox TV. We are taking down the Innovative Marine Fusion 20. This is one of our display tanks here in the store. It's been running for, how long has this tank been running? Two and a half years. Two and a half, two and a half? Is that what we agree on? Crazy, crazy growth. It's overgrown. So we're at the point with, with this tank where corals are, there's just a lot of warfare. Everything's touching and it looks great, but we're on the verge of sort of a collapse. Like, you know, the Cyphastria is touching the Lepastria, which is killing the Astriopora, which is touching the Goniopora, next to the Alveopora, next to the encrusting Goniopora. It's done so well, it's so grown, that, like, look at this. You see the bird's nest in the back? The corals do not stop growing, and they will grow over one on top of one another. Let's say we, we left this tank for three years without touching it. I would imagine one or two of the corals would take out all the other ones, sort of this natural selection process as they grow. They're all consuming for, for light and for the same nutrients. And in a small tank like this, it just needs constant pruning, constant attention, and it's done really, really well. So why not prune it and keep doing that? We are no longer selling. Um, I don't think we're gonna be selling these tanks here anymore, the innovative Marine Fusion 20. Great tank. Um, just gonna switch directions. We're gonna try different size. We'll we're gonna be talking more about these in the coming weeks. We're gonna leave the Evo and we're gonna set up three, maybe four different nano reefs uh, here in the store. So this little section of the store, we're crazy here. We get bored, you come in here every two months, I promise you something is gonna be different in the store. So this little section doot, 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 is all gonna come out and then we're gonna, we're gonna install three or four new tanks. So that's, that's one reason, the overgrowth. Um, and it's time, sometimes a tank, it's just, it's just time. It looks good, maybe better to end it while it's good than wait for stuff to go downhill. Like here, the acans are getting destroyed. Destroyed by the hammers, you see this? Uh, maybe a little bit poor placement decision making, but this one's virtually gone, and eventually these ones would be too, so they gotta move. Mm. See these ones back here? They're growing over one another. You can do acan gardens, to a limit, there is a limit to it. This is an amazing Favia. This was grown from a little itty bitty frag. Gets a ton of attention in the store and it's the fluffiest Favia I've ever seen. A lot of the corals I am going to keep. I do have an emotional and sentimental attachment to some like that Favia. I'm in love with this Aiken here. Gets a lot of attention. So if you come in the store, I'm going to be very sad to tell you, not for sale. I'm gonna probably grab that Aiken and add it here to um, my Aiken little collection that we have going on here. And this display tank kind of find a spot in there. Personal favorite of mine, Acan Corals. Uh, yeah, so the rest of, the, some of them are gonna get fragged up. The tank I, I imagine will be for sale. And then we're on to the next project, something new and exciting and um, it's fun to build and cycle and, and it's just fun to change it up. Also, you know what, I'm just gonna comment. I don't like to speak poorly about any other companies, but customer service from uh, these guys over here, not the best. I'm looking for help for replacement pumps. I don't think they watch your videos. I don't think it matters. I do like their products. We have, you know, their their Chato Max. I do like their Fuge Lights. This is a great little tool, the AccuDrip. And it's, they actually make my favorite reactor, internal reactor on the market. But when it comes to service, when I need help from them, um, not even for just customers, I'm waiting, like I'm trying to get in touch for two pumps. I had duds out of the box. And for my own pump, for something that we're using personally here in the store, customer service, I'm gonna give it a thumbs down. Not responsive, not on their A game. And uh, yeah, so that's, that's not really the deciding reason, but you know me, I like to speak, I like to tell you guys the good and the bad. And the good is definitely what's going on here in this Evo 13 and a half gallon. Uh, da boom this is a beautiful little tank I think that's it we're gonna wrap this one up a little bit of a shorter video today guys just wanted to sort of document it and give you a little update on what is going on here in the store and it's nice to look back and look oh my god that tank was crazy do you guys remember that because if we don't record it then we're gonna forget because I'm getting old and that's the end of the video we will see you guys back here very soon hopefully you liked it give us a thumbs up and subscribe because we try to do a video here as often as we can. What are you doing, Mr. Hermit Crab? He's doing he's doing parkour. 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 Thanks guys. We'll see you back here soon.